was such a it's such a great honor to receive the distinguished engineering award at Purdue. Um, I've been um, thinking about this day and thinking about all the wonderful memories um, I've had at Purdue, and in so many different ways, I feel like Purdue has been kind of the foundation um, has really kind of set helped me set the right foundation for myself and has helped me kind of, you know, get to a lot of these amazing experiences over the last decade and a half because of the time I spent at Purdue. Uh, and so a few things come to mind on this very special day. Um, I still remember the, my first day at Purdue, I uh, checked, I kind of took a flight from India to Indiana and, and, and kind of this cold, uh, uh, I think it was kind of a cold like fall day, but I remember checking into Cary Quad. That was my first dorm that I that I stayed in. And up until this point, I had never actually lived uh, away from home. And so just kind of being halfway around the world and the other side uh, and kind of meeting all these amazing kind of new folks who were joining college with me was, uh, was, was exciting, but also fairly nerve wracking for me, just kind of being so far away from, from, friend, uh, from friends and family. Um, but, you know, I think Purdue is just kind of, I think, filled with really warm people, people who I've still kind of kept in touch with, built so many amazing friendships and, and relationships with, uh, whether it's the people I met there uh, as fellow kind of students, but also professors that I'm still in touch with. Um, and also, I think, uh, as I look back, you know, I've now been in the professional world uh, for 14 years since I graduated Purdue. Uh, but Purdue was, back in 2003, was, was the place I had my first job. Uh, I took the job as um, kind of, uh, as part of the food crew or kind of the, uh, you know, in carry quadrangle. And, and it was a simple job, it was just kind of cleaning and making sure like all the dishes are in order. But it kind of made me understand the value of time and money and kind of, uh, it was the first time I got to like earn something. And I remember uh, spending many weeks kind of, getting my paycheck, which allowed me to maybe fly to New York on my own for the first time. And that really kind of made me feel a lot more independent. And, and you know, from there on, I did many more jobs at Purdue. I kind of uh, did research. I was a lab assistant. Uh, and then I landed my first real internships, part of the Purdue co-op program. But I got to work at Lutron, which was also started by a Purdue alum. Uh, and I did a few rotations there. And it really kind of made me into the person I am today. Uh, I've kind of had a wonderful career since then, but I think those early days, those early kind of internships really had a huge impact in kind of building the discipline uh, and, and kind, of, kind of keeping your, you know, keeping the focus and working hard towards, towards kind of the goals you have. I think it really kind of, those experiences had a huge impact on me. Uh, and then I think to kind of close it out, I think also on the work side, um, I remember being in my last year at, at, uh, at Purdue and I was really itching to um, move out west and, and, and kind of get into the world of venture capital. And, and even though a lot of the VC firms don't end up coming to Purdue, I was able to talk to uh, the advisor. Uh, I also talked to Dr. Balakrishnan, uh, who was a professor. Uh, and then also talked to folks who were really kind of were connected to alums, Purdue alums around the world. And I remember uh, someone connected me to SDL, which became my kind of first full-time job after college. It was literally Purdue helping me kind of land uh, uh, in California. And that literally changed my life. I mean, I think that led to me uh, uh, kind of joining Stanford the year after. Uh, and Stanford, I think, probably valued a lot of the research work that I did uh, with Dr. Perulis uh, at, at, at Purdue uh, that actually eventually led to a paper that's been cited so many different times. As an undergrad, you know, this was kind of a dream that, that happened during my time there. Uh, I can kind of go on and on, but I think just kind of thinking about my professional world, so many of my experiences at Purdue has really made me who I am today. Um, and also there's a lot of fun. I, I, I still remember, I think Purdue was uh, just kind of every Saturday morning, uh, waking up to, uh, I remember I kind of lived one year in hilltop apartments right next to the stadium and just the excitement uh, people had going into these games. It was just extraordinary. 
um, to feel just kind of the amount of pride each of our students and alums had. Uh, and, and something, the pride that I still have today, I think every time I see someone wearing a, a Boilerman uh, sweatshirt, it's like so fun to just go up to them and talk to them about these experiences that I had uh, together. And then lastly, I think uh, I would say uh, it's been really fun to watch Purdue from the sidelines since I graduated 14 years ago. Uh, it's been amazing to watch how Purdue has been able to still remain affordable for everyone. It's expanded access to education. Uh, and, and I kind of serve on the board of the electrical computer engineering. And it's been really fun to watch how uh, Purdue has emerged as one of the best run institutions. Uh, I feel really proud about that today. Uh, and so it's a real honor to accept this uh, award for being a distinguished engineer. Uh, and, I, and I hope that I can continue to make uh, Purdue University proud uh, in the future.